When looking at data, I would say in the past couple of years, data has um, become a new friend of mine. It wasn't always a strength of mine. Um, and using data to drive instruction has been um, one of the shifts in my learning, especially um, in meeting with our teams. I'm wondering about her spelling in her writing, um, just to get at her sounds. Um, I'm wondering if she could pull out a middle syllable, if she could say a word without the first syllable, if we worked a little bit more at the phonological level right. to and I, see if maybe she's not understanding. Right, and I did just start auditory battery with her towards the end of the year, and I have noticed see? a change, so I think, again, hit the ground running with that at the beginning of the year, and she actually will, she's on my class list for me moving up to third next year, so I think that will be great, what you said about already having a relationship with her in the family, she'll feel comfortable but then really hitting those skills because her writing is beautiful but the spelling is when we're looking at data we look at our dibbles data we look at our formative assessment data that we take at table every day um, like a Galileo testing that second grade uses as well as any other assessments or table time work that the kids use we look at their data and are all the data points lining up to make sense is there a hole in one spot of the data and what can we do to better meet the students needs based on those data points